Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Royce the Jockey, and welcome to a little Saturday story time, if you will. I have the craziest story ever. Okay, this morning, got up, went to Subway, because that's where I'm going to start working, and I had to go fill out paperwork, okay? Yeah, that's what happened. Anyway, then we ate lunch at Subway, and I came home, and I took all my fish out of my giant 55-gallon fish tank, so I could redecorate, clean the gravel, and move all the stuff around, okay? I'm saying okay a lot, and I'm out of breath, because this is surprising. So I put all my fish into a five-gallon bucket that was just sitting on the ground. And then after I put the decorations and stuff in, then I put all the fish back in. But what I didn't know is that when I was downstairs getting more water for the tank, one of my fish jumped out of the bucket under my bed. So this fish has been under my bed for like two and a half hours, and then I reached under, I reached, I looked under my bed to go grab something, and there's my fish. Like, I thought, like, I thought he was dead, okay? I thought he was dead, he was all dried up, he had like dog hair on it. Um, sorry, I just got a notification on my phone. But I thought he was dried up, so I grabbed him, I was really sad, because it was, it was my nice light blue fish, neon gourmet. Very beautiful stuff. Hey, Ninja Turtles. Ooh, pizza. Ooh. Don't look at that. Anyway, so I grabbed him with my hand, which I'm thankfully I did. I grabbed him with my hand, started taking him downstairs to go flush him down the toilet, rest in peace. And then out of the blue, I thought, I felt like a little jolt, like he jolted up like a fish out of water. But anyway, and I'm like, was that the fish? So you're like, okay, I'm not going to go flush it down the toilet, and I'm glad I did not. So I just threw it, or I set him in one of my uh, tanks that has no other fish in it, just has, like, water in it. And I let him sit there for, like, two minutes while I got uh, my computer started up. And I look back over, and I think I see he's just still, he's still just laying on his side at the bottom. But he is breathing. He is breathing. He was still alive. Okay? He, he like, I, 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 I brought this fish back from the dead, so I'm like, okay, there's a little chance that he could still live. So I put him in, like, a little tiny, uh, two-gallon, like, beta tank, uh, so that way there's more air or oxygen to the water ratio in a smaller tank for the fish. I have a bubbler going in there, so that way more oxygen gets produced. And at first, he, he got, he was a little jolty, sorry, I'm shaking, he was a little jolty, uh, I put some food in there, he eventually, like, floated up on the side, and he ate a little bit of it, so I get, so I get him a little strength. I kept the bubbler going, I changed the water out, so, because it got all hairy from the, the hair that was on the fish. I put some slime coat in the new water that he's in, and I'm pretty sure that he is going to make it, unless something happens with, like, his slime coat or something. But I have the bubbler going, and he is swimming around in his little tiny tank. I'm not gonna put him in back into the big tank quite yet because I don't want him to get picked on but I'll, I'll show you guys here in a second hold on okay guys there he is he's breathing uh he's I don't know if he'll make it but let's just hope and pray to God that he will um but he I like this fish and I just hope he makes it through see there's a little gill he was swimming around I have the bubbler off but I'm gonna hope that he makes here he is up on its front so let's just let's just pray Organized fish tank, 55 gallon that he was in. Got some more of his species, blue gourmet. I really like them. Silver dollars, a lot of algae because all the gravel got turned around, so I have to scoop that stuff out. But I just pray to God that he makes it. I'll get I'll let you guys updated in a video and probably one of my videos that I'm gonna record. But if he doesn't, then I'm just gonna have to get another one because he jumped, but he's still alive. So I mean. Maybe it'll take a couple of days for him to get back vibrant and stuff. But, yeah, um, I just hope that he does. But anyway, this is Joystick Jockey with a little story time Saturday. See you guys in the next video on Tuesday. Peace! <laughs>